Cycling Without Age has been an awesome opportunity to get involved um, with different generations that I might not normally see around Denmark um, and get active and get really involved in the bike culture as well. He is just such a hoot. He always brings a smile to my face um, and it's super fun hanging out with him and hearing about his experiences in Copenhagen. Cycling Without Age has taught me um, that connection with others goes past age and culture and no matter who you are or where you're from or what generation you're from, um, there's always a uh, uniting factor. Probably my favorite elder at Biking Without Age is Nils. His laugh is contagious. His humor is out of this world. Sometimes we're not always on the same page, but we always manage to laugh and have a good time. And Cycling Without Age was the perfect way for us to get involved with the Copenhagen community. Yeah, so for me, Cycling Without Age isn't just about cycling because I'm not the most comfortable with cycling myself. So I've really enjoyed being a passenger, getting to dance around and sing with Niels, um, hear Carl tell some really cool stories, um, take them to a museum, go to a wine tasting, just so many cool opportunities that I just love having the privilege of getting to do. Yeah, for me, it's been so special. Um, going around Copenhagen and discovering it with people who have so much knowledge and so many stories to tell about it and just interacting with the elders has been amazing. Each time that I've gone has been so interesting and fun and not only do I love just biking and being outside and learning how to use the cargo bikes um, but every passenger that I've taken out on a ride has been incredible and so kind and I've had such interesting conversations. And I think this organization is truly unlike anything I've ever heard of and so unique. We were all just laughing the whole time and it was just overall a very positive experience. I really enjoyed it. I would really recommend it to any other American students and I would really recommend it to any other places looking to host one of these programs. I love it so much. Uh, I, a really good memory I have is when I, the first time I rode was with Eric and um, every time we would pass a small dog, he would go, there's another carpet pisser, and it was just really funny, and um, we talked about lots of things, some things kind of deep and some things um, more lighthearted. I left feeling very fulfilled, like I had done something really great with my day and my time, um, and I know that students who went there afterwards said that Alfred had mentioned me um, and really enjoyed uh, writing with me so much that he told his daughter who was there visiting with him. Uh, so it does make an impact and I'd encourage anybody who's considering it to go and do it. I think that Cycling Without Age is an incredibly unique and fun opportunity to experience the city you're in in a completely different way. Uh, being able to cycle around with some people that have been in Copenhagen so much longer than you have and experienced it in different ways than you have and having them point out you know, their favorite spots and where they want to spend the afternoon and where they used to live. It's just a really uh, fun time. Cycling Without Age has taught me that no one knows a city better than those that have lived there the longest. I've learned so much from the people that I've ridden bikes around with Copenhagen and they have so many fun stories to tell and it's truly an experience that I'll never get anywhere else. The semester I've gone to Cycling Without Age quite a lot and built some very strong connections to the residents like Kel, Carl, and Nils, all of whom I love dearly and will miss a lot when we have to leave soon. Um, I've been to a bunch of events with the residents and the most memorable is Nils' 93rd birthday party where I met his family and they showed me pictures of him when he was younger and found out some crazy cool facts about his amazing life. Um, this program has taught me that age doesn't end mobility um, and that people who have been alive so much longer than me have so much to teach me um, and I hope to continue the same thing in the U.S. when I go back.